Hey guys, Alex from 7th Hour Films back again with JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. Last time around we had Enter the FF. The, the, the ones who fight the foos. Uh, so yeah, I don't know what that was supposed to be, but I guess this is fighting foos. You fight foos? I don't know. Anyway. So yeah, FF kept fighting Kenzo. Oh, that was his name, right? I think that was it. And it was a whole big thing uh, that resulted in uh ff being put in an electric chair but then blasting him but then he came after jolene after jolene gave her some water to revive herself uh or to give ff to revive themselves and then uh and then what the hell is his name anastasia that was it he uh intervened once jolene was going to be harmed and completely just screwed that dude's insides with diver drive so yeah Anyway, we are now off to find the person who has Dio's bone, so it's pretty much where we're at. Uh, yeah, like always, the reaction is down in the description and the pinned comment for your viewing pleasure. So why don't we go ahead and jump right into this episode of JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. Here we go. He doesn't make it easy. He doesn't make it easy. Um... I have a headache. <laughs> I actually have a headache. Like, I'm not even playing this up. I have a headache now. Well, I guess Dio's coming back. The question still remains, is it Dio... I mean, let's face the facts, it is Dio. There's no way it's not Dio. But. There's a part of me that really, really wants it to be Jonathan. You know? So, is this the work of, this, of the Roman? Or is this the bone? Like, they kind of made it sound like, no, the bone is doing this. You know? The bone is doing this as some way of, like, regrowing. Which, if it is the bone, if it's the bone doing it, and remember this bone was originally the bone of Jonathan Joestar, that's not too weird, because that could be a, like... A type of hamon, you know, or you know, like because because we've seen Jonathan with his hamon, you know, when he first uh, touched that tree after Baron Zeppeli unlocked his hamon, basically all all of that, you know, that vine bloomed, basically all those flowers bloomed from his hamon, and at the same time, there is some precedent to that as well. Because the blood son of the, the biological son of Jonathan Joestar is Giorno Giovanna, whose stand creates life. So if it is the bone, it's actually not too far out there. It's a little far. But the thing is, is it Dio or is it Jonathan? Because whatever is being born has the Joestar birthmark. But that was Jonathan's birthmark. You know? That was Jonathan's first. And presumably this bone... Because, I mean, Dio's head was obliterated by Jotaro. But... I also thought the body was completely vaporized in the sunlight in Egypt. Somehow, 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 Pucci managed to get one of the bones, but... So I don't know. I don't know about that. 
I mean, I would love if there's like some big climactic thing where it's like where Poochie it, like it seems like Poochie has won and Dio is revived and then just from this like cocoon just bursts out Jonathan Joestar and then he beats the shit out of him, you know? I would absolutely love for Jonathan Joestar to be revived, you know? Now, granted, I mean, this won't... I guess either way, will this actually be Jonathan or Dio? And again, presuming it's Dio. Presuming it's Dio. Again, will it be Dio? Or will it just be something like Dio? You know? Presumably it won't have... But I guess, no, I guess he's banking on the bone containing Dio's memories, you know? He's banking on it having Dio's memories. Would it still have the world? And I mean, we just also established that whole thing with Jotaro, you know? That Jotaro, even without his memory, still has... I mean, it's the difference of the memories and the soul. That's what the two discs are. It's just that stand users, their soul is their stand, you know? So Jotaro's soul is still with him because he has Star Platinum, you know? But he doesn't fully have his memories. Does the bone contain the memories of Dio or the stand of Dio? The essence of Dio? Or is it Jonathan Joestar? But no, it has to be the the the, the Roman centurion. Cause his stand, it's obvious that that's his stand, and then he like created this chair of plants, so he's doing it. I don't know. Um, I. Uh, a g good thing from this episode, I really like Diver Drive. Like, that's, that's, that's a fun stand. It's, the way he uses it is incredibly brutal, but I just like that he can just set a trap in a dude, basically, you know? And we did find the person who had Survivor, so. This has been rough. This has been a bit of a rough stretch of episodes, you know? And... So basically from episode 15 to now, we still got a lot of, we still got a long way to go. We've got about 28 episodes left of part six, which is good. Um, they're now maybe not 28. No, it's, it's, no, 18. That's what I'm thinking of. If I could do simple math. Yeah, we've got about... We've got about 18 episodes left, so we're about at the halfway point of the season. In fact, this episode is the halfway point of the season. So, yeah. I got nothing else. That's it. Weird episode, weird stuff, but I, I did like the, uh, the, the little deadly plant stand guy. I again, he... Like the dragon, it's like, he's really, really complicated and hard to understand. But he's kind of funny, so I kind of give it a pass, you know? So, yeah, that's it. With all that being said, I'm Alex from 7th Hour Films, and I will see you guys next time. Take care. Alright guys, thanks for watching this video. There's a bunch of links on screen if you want to go click around any of those. There's a playlist for all of my JoJo's Bizarre Adventure reactions, as well as another video you can go click on if you want. There's also a subscribe button and a Patreon button on screen, as well as other links in the description if you want to go check out any of those. See you guys later.